Once upon a time, there was a plucky squire named Jot. Jot lived in the land of Mojo, a land of creativity. Mojo was ruled by the gentle queen, Chroma. He defended the land from the nefarious sorcerer, Humgrubble. Which everyone very much appreciated. Good lad! Well done! Racky. Jot was also a writer and would transcribe his many adventures in book form. These tales were avidly read by all the people of the land, who found them quite gripping. Jot awoke one fine morning and pluckily leapt from his bed. From afar, he could hear some rather exciting music. He got dressed and went to investigate. Chapter 1 Some Serious Beeswax This was the house of the good wizard, Moonbeard, Jot's close friend and mentor. Ah, Jot, my lad! He exclaimed. I'm on a roll here, traveling to new musical realms. Since you're here, lad, I have a small favor to ask. Wax. I need more wax, lad. To press more records, you know. Would you go to Honey Peak and get some wax from Benny B? Pip here will accompany you. Honey Peak. <gasps> now this looked really quite Precarious.
honey badger seemed rather annoyed. Jot prepared for a dust-up. The beast was bested. Yes. The plucky squire triumphant. Down they fell! <laughs> it was time to confer with Moonbeard. It was Violet. Violet was a trainee witch with a love of art. And Jot's childhood friend.
Brother. Chapter 2 Tome Tower Our heroes hung on to the cliff's edge by their fingernails, when suddenly they were grabbed and hoisted up. By who? By Thrash. Thrash was a mountain troll. And Jot and Violet's childhood friend. The trio had not been together for quite a while. And so were very happy to be reunited.
Our trio stopped in their tracks, there, on the horizon, loomed Chome Tower.
Jot made his way up the steep steps. And so, the Pluggy Squire once again defeated the wretched wizard Humdrum.
Chapter Three: Moonbeard.
And so our heroes set off to Artia City to visit the good Queen Chroma. Chapter 4 A Treacherous Trail On the way to Artia, our heroes took a shortcut through the aquatic land known as the Sonnet Swamps. <laughs> 